A pest that we've seen in the Colorado mountains has now been found much, much closer to Denver. The emerald ash borer has been found in Littleton. So let's talk more about what that all means with Sean Hose, an arborist and tree expert. He's a district manager of the South Denver Davy Tree Office. Sean, thanks so much for the time. Tell us, what is the latest here? Uh, so it was recently found in Littleton, uh, right about the corner of Broadway and Bellevue. Uh, before that, it was found about 13 miles north, so it jumped about 13 miles south, uh, pretty much now covering most of Denver. It is now here. And of course, just for those people that don't know, it's a beetle that eats trees and really just kills them, messes with them. Tell me, what's the actual uh, terminology here? Uh, so it's a, it's a small beetle, about only a half inch long. Uh, it burrows into the tree. Uh, pretty much taking out all of the nutrients that pretty much uh, all of the root structures that go up to the tree, uh, allowing pretty much no growth to get to the tree and slowly kills them. Most trees are dying within two to four years. So with it being found in Littleton, in the Denver Metro, what's the big concern? Uh, for the fact that uh, about one in five trees here in Littleton area and just over Den Denver overall uh, are ash trees. Uh, this beetle, if it gets into the tree and not taken care of will kill the trees. And so that's a possible loss of one to five trees and the whole canopy overall. So obviously uh, you, you mentioned it jumped 13 miles. This, this isn't something slow. This could be a pretty rapid thing. So what should people do uh, if they're worried about their trees, if all of a sudden they're kind of tree in their backyard starts to look a little funny? Uh, so if you're starting to see any kind of uh, dieback in your tree, so especially the top third of the tree, starting to see uh, yellowing leaves, dying branches, uh, get your tree checked out. Uh, it also leaves a capital D-shaped uh, hole, and uh, they're very tiny uh, in the tree that shows where they're uh, burrowing out of and into the tree. Uh, if you have an ash tree on your property or you don't know you have an ash tree, I recommend getting someone out there to get it treated to make sure you're protecting it. Because it is cheaper to do that than to potentially have to replace an entire dead tree. Sean, thanks so much for the information today. Of course. Thank you.